The wig really does change the entire persona I take on. I mean, it's big and glamorous, and on top of that, I have a crown on top of my head, and it really makes me feel like a princess, so that transformation completely helps my acting. Hey, my name is Sonia Balsara. I play Jasmine in Disney's Aladdin on Broadway. I'm backstage at the theater right now. It's about an hour until showtime, and come check out my hair prep before the show. The schedule is very intense. We do eight shows a week, and it's when the rest of the world is sort of relaxing. <laughs> so I think finding balance between your social life and your working life is really important. I think I've done close to 300 shows now, maybe a little bit less, and keeping it fresh every day, finding new things to play with as an actor is a challenge for sure, and it's a really exciting challenge. I went through a process of learning how to do the makeup for the show. I have to do it myself every single day, so I've gotten pretty good at doing makeup. <laughs> I love the detail of everything. So like with my like eye makeup, for example, I have these little pink sparkles that I put here at the end. And I have a lipstick change from the beginning of the show to the end, and that represents something about how she's grown and the choices she's making. So every day, um, after I do my makeup, my hair gets put in pin curls. And this is a really important and very specific process. There's specific placement for every pin curl so that when they put my wig on, it can be pinned exactly in the right spot as well as my different uh, accessories. Like my, I have three different crowns that I wear throughout the show. What's great about this is that I don't have to style my hair every day. Like have, getting to wear a wig lets me have freedom to take care of my hair, not put product in it, not like curl it every day. So it keeps my hair really healthy, which is a great thing. And then I put a wig cap on top of it so a wig can go on my head as well as a microphone. Now I have my wig cap on, my hair's all prepped, I have my mic on, and I'm gonna put my costume on. The costumes are unbelievably beautiful. All of the little crystals all over. One of the things that I do is think about how the costumes inform how I stand and like even feeling the material just like really puts me into the world. So my very first week, it's actually my first two show day in Aladdin. The skirt that I wear <laughs> in the last number is really, really heavy and it was really long at the time. And my foot got caught in the skirt and I fell on my face in center stage in front of 1,700 people. And uh, I got right back up and finished the dance and it was a very humbling experience. <laughs> the wigs are absolutely incredible. So they basically like saran wrap my head with plastic and with tape and figure out the exact size of my head. And then they make a wig specifically for my head and literally take hair by hair to create all of this. And it's really, really amazing and, and magical. The, the art of creating the wig and then also the art of styling the wig. So it gets washed, it gets put in curlers and taken out and then styled. It's it's definitely heavy, but it, um, it is not un it's not like uncomfortable or painful, I would say. Like it's it's pretty comfy for how heavy it is. <laughs> Every day I get to step on stage as Princess Jasmine and represent all of my identity, and that is a rare thing to get to do in this industry. And getting to own like my Indian heritage, my Persian heritage, my even my American heritage, because this is a world that exists. It's a, it's a melting pot of cultures. That's like a really, really special part of the show for me too. Jasmine fights to be a leader and we need more female leaders. And it's so awesome to even be in this room with you know women on the other side of the camera. Like that doesn't happen all the time. And I think that having women in all different positions and with a common goal is um, also the reason that I'm here telling the story every day. Thanks for spending my pre-show with me and it's time to go do the show. See ya. This is probably my most treasured item in my dressing room. This is the Hindu goddess Saraswati. Um, she's the goddess of wisdom and music and learning. It's just like, it's very grounding to look at her every day and be reminded of my roots. And um, yeah, I say like a little prayer to myself sometimes too. <laughs>